She hasn't been feeling too well lately. She has a big molar coming in, and poor thing has been in so much pain and kind of grumpy, but it just came through, so hopefully she'll be better now. But today is the weekend, so we decided we are going to baby-proof the house. So we're gonna wait. Uh, Dad is in the shower, so I'm gonna give her a snack, and then we're gonna start working on getting everything ready. Yeah. Want a snack? Does it finish your yogurt? I've never given her blueberries before, so let's see what she thinks of this. She's very cautious when it comes to foods, especially new foods. Hmm. Well, we'll leave those there while I give her her yogurt. <laughs> I recently switched her over to an almond milk yogurt. She loves her yogurt in the morning. However, I've noticed she's been spitting up a lot more lately. And we've also stopped with formula. Now that she's a year old, we switched to 100% full fat milk. And I don't know if maybe she's having a reaction to all the dairy. So I'm just kind of testing a few things and trying out some almond milk, see if that helps. But she also could just be spitting up more because of the tooth. She kind of does that sometimes. She spits up a lot when she's teething. You got yogurt on you. <laughs> We need to get you cleaned up before we start baby proofing everything. I got these magnetic um, safety locks for the cabinets. My sister had these when her kids were little and I like the magnetic ones. And then I also had to go and buy these toilet lid locks. She has just discovered the toilet and she loves lifting the lid up, trying to reach in the toilet. Um, she's throwing things in there right now. So we have got to end this and put a lock on there so she can't get in there anymore because it's getting pretty gross. And of course, the first thing we did was put outlet covers on all the open outlets that she can reach. That was an easy one. Going to be doing toilet first. This is greatly going to upset her. And she won't be able to get in. You gonna take all those out? Here. Here. Spit up. Spit up happens. See, I don't know. Maybe it is the yogurt or the dairy. I think it is. I know. I think because that was the almond milk, though. So maybe it's the regular milk that's causing her to spit up so much. Uh, Layla. Oh, no. It's sticky. It's sticky. <laughs> We gotta put it down. We gotta put it down. There. Okay, I gotta do this fast. And there goes the toilet paper. And there goes the toilet paper. No! You're a disaster! Alright, there. That was easy. Then to open it, you just press this, push that up, and it slides over. Done. Bless you! Alright, moving on to the kitchen. It's okay. We just don't want you getting into any of the cabinets with glass and cleaning stuff. I think I bought the adhesive one, so these should be easy to do too. What? What? Ah, she's fighting my camera. No! Shade. Yay! And then you use the magnet to open it. Yay! Good job, Dad! Alright, now I just gotta do all the rest of them. Have fun! Actually, that wasn't too bad. That won't take long. Nope. Well, those are the main things we wanted to get baby proof today. So we do have one other thing coming from Amazon, and those are not uh, covers for your stove knobs. Our stove has knobs that are right on the side, and so even Brian and I are always like running into them and knocking them, and they turn on. So as soon as those come, they should be arriving today from Amazon. We'll put those on too, and then we should be good. Fortunately, we don't have like a coffee table or anything like that with sharp corners that we need to um, cover, and everything else is pretty baby-proof, so I think we're good. All right, let's play out here for a little bit. 
because you're kind of cranky. I feel so bad because I think her teeth are really bothering her or she might have like a little bit of an earache. She's just been really fussy lately and banging her head against the wall, which I read means sometimes like babies do that when they're teething and they're in pain and it's to distract them, which makes me so sad. So I don't know, we're just keeping an eye on her, but she's very, very fussy today. So we're doing anything we can to keep her happy. We finally got her some little shoes. Well, they're dirty right now, but these are the Robies shoes and they're perfect for her for crawling. Beforehand, we always just had her in socks and her socks would get so nasty and so dirty and disgusting. But now with the shoes, it kind of protects her feet a little bit more while she's crawling and don't get as dirty either. Now her jeans on the other hand are a disaster. She has like probably four pairs of jeans. I think all of them but one, the one she's wearing right now, have holes now in the jeans. I'm ready for this crawling stage to be over. Well, I think we're actually going to head out and maybe try, try being the operative word there, to do a walk around the lake and see if that makes her happy. Sometimes just getting outside and doing something different will help her mood. So we're gonna go do that and hope for the best. <laughs> Ready, girl? I thought it would be cute to put some little flower stickers on her car, but unfortunately she just picks them all off as we're, as we're going. Don't you, girl? About halfway through, she gets fed up with the car. Daddy has to hold her. <laughs> Zeke's still going strong. Good boy, Zeke. Look at the baby ducks, Layla Jane. See the duckies? <laughs> I love watching her face when she sees something for the first time. <laughs> what do you think of them? That's like a your size duck. <laughs> Picking your legs, you excited. <laughs> We were just getting ready to leave when we realized we don't have her wub enough, so I have to go back and hunt that down. Think I see it. Excuse me, duck. Uh, some kind person put it up for us. That would have been very bad if we had lost that. Unfortunately, this isn't the first time that's happened. She's dropped it a few times, like especially at Target, and I'll get her all buckled in, ready to head home, and I realize we don't have it. We have to go back into Target, retrace our steps. It happens, but you know what? What are you gonna do? You have to go back and find it. Layla Jane has been asleep now for about an hour and a half, which is great because she really needed the rest. She didn't take a very good nap this morning. And just now, Amazon came and delivered our stove knobs. And of course, they rang the doorbell and Zeke started barking. Even though we have a sh baby a sleeping sign, I guess I just ignored that. But thankfully, she didn't wake up. But I'm gonna use this time while she's sleeping to put the knobs on the stove. easy, now I just gotta do the rest of them. Perfect, now none of us will be accidentally turning these on when we walk by it. Finished just in time, I think I hear her stirring in there. Up, oh, looks like she's moving, maybe just repositioning. We'll see up, oh no, she's up. I better go get her. Hi baby girl. We decided to come over to Grandma and Grandpa's house for a little bit so Layla Jane could play in her water table and maybe we'll go to the park later. The park in their neighborhood has baby swings, which she loves, so we like coming over to this park. Ah! 
Oh man, soaking wet now. <laughs> it's a good thing it's gotten warmer out. Probably feels good to you. I've had to strip the shirt off because that was soaked. That's up in the dryer. Fortunately, we have another pair of jeans here, so those can get as wet as you want, girl. Oh, and she's off. And we're just down to the diaper now. So before we sign off for the day, I have to show you something really funny. She absolutely loves the song, um, what's it called? Oh, A Friend Like Me from Aladdin. And when you play it on Alexa, she goes crazy. Alexa, play A Friend Like Me. Here's Friend Like Me. <gasps> From Aladdin. Uh oh. On Amazon Music. Ah! <laughs> <gasps> Is that your song? <laughs> Yay! That was about half as exciting as she usually gets. But I think she's eating a cracker right now, so she didn't want to give her full attention to it. Normally, she starts crawling around and clapping. It's so cute. Well, thank you for joining us today as we baby-proofed our house, went for a walk, and now just playing over at Grandma and Grandpa's. We had a great time today, and please make sure to subscribe and follow us on Instagram at HeyMamas18. Bye.